Unify is a great network system, but what happens if it breaks down? What happens if your dream machine just blacks out? It's not that hard to fix and replace the broken uh, dream machine with a new one. And uh, it's about the same process as if you want to do a migration from one dream machine to another dream machine. So in both those cases, this will work. Even if the process it in itself actually is pretty easy, it can be a little bit uh, confusing. In this video, I'm going to take you through the process of replacing a broken uh, dream machine or if you want to migrate to a new one. So buckle up and let's get started. The first thing you want to do is just to power down the old UVM. Then remove all the wiring and cables and just remove it from the rack. Now just install the new UVM in the rack, connect all the cables and turn it on. Now just uh, open the Unify app on your mobile phone. It can be a little bit confusing when you open it because it will probably pop up with other units also that's already in your network or near you. Just wait until you get a new device found and you can see that your new uh, dream machine is popping up. Now click setup and wait until it have recognized and connected to the device. In the screen that now pops up, you choose Restore from Backup. A new list will pop up, and from this list you can choose which backup or network you want to restore. Choose the network and click Next. Now the chosen backup will be restored. This process will take some time, so have patience. For me, the process took about 25 minutes. I have sped up the process here so you will see what's uh, happening. But uh, be aware, under this process your phone may connect or disconnect to the network. There will be a lot of strange pop-up messengers coming on the screen. But uh, basically have patience. After this process is complete you will see the blue button go to dashboard. Click on it. Next you will get a new screen. Click continue. From the dashboard you will now see that all your devices is uh, getting adapted into the new system. This may take a little while but it's a pretty fast process. By clicking on units I can see that all my network units are there. And when I click on clients I can see that uh, every device is now connected and up and running again. You can also do this process directly from your machine by typing in unify backslash in your browser, but I found it uh, a lot more unstable and confusing. If you go into Ubiquiti's uh, site manager, you will now see that your uh, new network is uh, up and running, but you will also see that the old network is still there. The old network will have a time limit and you can't remove it until it's gone uh, 24 hours. I'm not sure why, but that's the way they've done it. Inside your new restored uh, network, you will see that every device is uh, getting restored and uh, set up. And uh, there you go, your network is now up and running again. Thank you for watching, and I'm really sorry about the sound uh, quality. My microphone has uh, been turned off, and uh, all the sound was just picked up from the laptop. So again, I'm really sorry about it, but I hope the video was uh, informative for you. Goodbye.